Brian here with you to look at this batch of five 19th century bound volumes of periodicals in attractive, actually handsome leather bindings of this era. Uh, these are all multiple months, typically six months uh, is in a bound volume. Uh, there is a profusion, I'll just lay it down like this so we can take a quick flip through. There, uh, look at that, a Stanhope press right there, wood frame hand press. Oh, this is an interesting growth of the woodcut printing. Well, that's a nice little article in and of itself. Oh, there we go, Albrecht Durer. Uh -huh. So uh, there's a, a wide range of uh, illustrations and topics. Uh, Louisiana, you know, you just name it. Uh, history of a pot of varnish. I mean, my goodness, that's so interesting, really. A home and society. Uh -huh. Peter the Great. Oh, look at this, an article on Edison's electric light. Huh, look at that. It's like science in here. Huh, look at that. It's interesting. All right, New England. Oh, a bicycle. Yeah, this is a, hours and hours and hours of pleasant reading here and browsing. Uh, well, what you've got are six months worth of a periodical that was in its day. Uh, had a very high standard for what it published. Um, Scribners, this one here, okay, and here at the front we see uh, that this is July through December for 1896, a little dinged right there, uh, slight little bit of corner edge damage to the first few leaves, but then it disappears, but again what we see here, uh, there's Brighton Beach, um, look at this, wilderness, Panther shooting in Central Asia, up in Central India, rather. Oh my goodness, oh. Uh, it's, it's like reading about uh, hunting elephants or something. It's just a little depressing and distressing, really. Uh, once upon a time, people used to take pride in that activity. Huh. <laughs> Brag about it. <laughs> it's pretty funny. I went and shot some animals. <laughs> yeah, that's great stuff, yeah. Uh, let's see. Oh my, there we go. That's very nice. That's a beautiful color. Uh, lithograph image. Uh -huh. City, oh yeah, Siena. Siena, that's a beautiful city right there in Italy. Brick, they run the Palio race there. Look at that gold reflective ink. Ah, oh, this is wonderful, yeah, that's beautiful. Circus, look at this, this is very nice. Yeah, this is great. What a, that's fantastic. Look at that, all gold reflective ink right there. Very nice. Yeah, maybe I'll just keep these. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, <laughs> this is Alaska. I know it's a lot of it's a lot of fun looking at these. Yeah, it's uh, it's a real snapshot into a, a different era in uh, American society. 1898. Okay. Do a quick flip, otherwise we'll be here for 20 minutes, which we could be just going through these. Okay, then we got a couple bound volumes of Lippincott. Okay, again, like so. And finally, this last one right here. Okay, sea serpents, diamonds, Florida. Does that say? Cracker's Cabin? I'm not sure what that is. I don't even know. Uh, substitute for a Navy. A college. Confederate Among the Pines. And this batch of five bound volumes, 1882, is currently available online from me, Brian DeMambro.